Narcissists are heavily dependent on people. Everything the narcissist does is designed to regulate their emotions and boost their self-esteem. Everything they do is designed to make them feel good. For them to feel good, their false self must be propped up. They need people to make them feel good because the false self is something that only exists on the surface. There is no real human within the narcissist because they have considered their true inner self as being worthless and ineffective at getting their needs met. The false self was invented as the replacement of their true inner self. Because the false self isn't real, it is very fragile and breaks easily under any pressure. It cannot support itself on its own energy or self-validation. The narcissist desperately tries to ensure the survival of their false self because it is all they have left. It is the only thing forming a barrier against the empty, meaningless void of their true inner self. The narcissist needs outside power and energy to survive. They are like a black hole that sucks the power and energy out of everyone around them. That is the only way that they can survive. They could also be compared to vampires, but rather than blood, they suck the life and energy out of you and they discard you like a corpse. Both the black hole and the vampire are dead. They're not really alive. They need to keep sucking and draining from those who are alive to sustain their false existence. Narcissists are already dead. There is no human being that exists within them. All you see on the surface is the false self, which is just bits and pieces that they have taken from other people or movies. The narcissist's actions really have nothing to do with them on a personal level, as there is no real person within them. There is no person to act for. Everything the narcissist does revolves around obtaining energy to ensure the survival of their false self. For this reason, the narcissist's actions revolve around their target. Their actions determine whether or not they are going to be able to extract energy from their target. So their actions revolve around their target. This can be a very empowering thing to understand. As although the narcissist may act as though they are powerful, they are actually completely powerless. They are heavily dependent on other people to provide them with the power and energy they need to sustain their false self. Without the power and energy required to sustain their false self, they are left with nothing but an empty, meaningless void.
For the narcissist to sustain their false self, they need constant attention, admiration and praise. They need to feel as though they are superior to those around them. They need to feel strong emotions that make them feel as though they are something significant. This confirms the existence and the validity of their false self. If you are a grade, so, grade A source of supply, they will enjoy tormenting you, causing you to experience severe mental, emotional or physical suffering. It makes the false self feel as though it exists and as though it is powerful and in control. A lower grade source of supply might be one where the narcissist is able to project their own self-hatred, self-rejection and insecurities onto someone. This takes the pressure off the narcissist and provides them with some relief to continue the delusional fantasy of their false self existing. The narcissist has such inner intense self-hatred and self-loathing that they need to constantly target the vulnerabilities, weaknesses and insecurities of other people. They make it their right to punish people for not reflecting back how impressive and real their false self is. They expect you to constantly feed their false self by giving it your power, energy, attention, admiration and praise which it constantly needs and requires to silence the inner, empty, meaningless void as it tries to consume them. If you cannot do this, they will automatically target your vulnerabilities, weaknesses and insecurities in an attempt to avoid being consumed by the empty, meaningless void within them. Everything the narcissist does is designed to obtain power, energy, attention, admiration and praise from the people around them. If you do not reflect back how impressive and real their false self is, they will make it their right to punish you and try to extract negative attention from you. They will enjoy tormenting you, causing you to experience severe mental, emotional or physical suffering. Whatever it takes, for them to feel as though their false self exists and as though they are powerful and superior to those around them. The narcissist has no real power, solidity or actuality. They are inciting you to give them your attention and energy to make them feel as though they exist. Only you can put an end to narcissistic abuse by taking your energy off the narcissist and putting it on yourself. If you take full responsibility for your vulnerabilities, weaknesses and insecurities, it leaves the narcissist with nothing to hook into or feed from. They will be left to fall back into the empty, meaningless void of nothingness and powerlessness where they belong. All of their lies and illusions will fall apart and they will no longer have any power over you. They have to trick you into giving your power to them. But if you see through their lies and illusions and you're no longer giving your power away, they're forced to return to their natural state of nothingness and powerlessness. 
then you will be able to source your power authentically from within. The only person you have the ability to change is yourself. The only person you are responsible for is yourself. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsforevercoaching at gmail.com. Check out the new merchandise in the Narcs Forever store where you can purchase your own Narcs Forever t-shirt, tank top or mug. The link is in the video description. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.